Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Boston, Massachusetts. This is Dave Stevens. With me, as usual, is analyst Mike Steele. Thanks, Dave. As they say, it's raining cats and dogs today, which provides a perfect time for me to be able to remind you to seek out your local animal shelter and adopt a pet this week. As for the players, they're in for quite a mess out there. Yeah, Mike, that's a good point. Well, Mike, I guess we'll just have to wait and see how this weather situation unfolds. Rowe catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 12. Well, we've got a report from Emma Adams down on the field. Emma, what do you have for us? I spoke with one of the coaches on the sideline about the rain. He said that both the players and the coach staff have had to adjust to the monsoon-like conditions. He continued by saying that the play calls are definitely being affected by the weather, but that it's football and great teams should always be able to adjust. Thanks for the update, Emma. Throws the ball near the middle of the field. And he stopped. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. Delgado from the gun. Delgado looking to pass. He flings a pass. And he stopped at the 43-yard line. That brings up second down. Second down and short. Delgado steps back into the pocket. Play action. He's taken down by Castro. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. Tight end right for the Whalers. Dropping back. Grabbed out of the air by number 82. First down. Dave, I never liked putting a wideout into a position to get hit like that. They will come back and ask for post routes all game long. Uh -huh. Pass complete to number 15. He pitches the ball to the runner. Eight play of the drive. He hands it to number 37. the kick and it will fall short of the uprights Go. he takes the ball Second down. Second down. Go! Throws it up beyond the first down.
Third down and short. Go! Linton takes the ball. And he's taken down back at the 24-yard line. That brings up fourth down. Miami will kick this one away. He punts it away. Rowe catches the punt. Makes the return up to the 43-yard line. The Whalers looking to get things going from the 44-yard line. He steps back to pass. Brought down in the backfield for a sack by number 55. That will bring up second down. He hands it to number 37. Third down. A five defensive back set for Miami. Go. Delgado back to pass. He throws one. Incomplete. Boston is set to kick this one away. Morgan on the punt. Number 89 catches the punt. He hands it to number 22. That gets us to second down. Put. The handoff is taken by number 22. And that's enough for a first down. It's runs like that, Dave, that helps set the tone for this game. Nothing fancy, just our guys beat your guys. Hike. He hands it to the runner. Tackle made by Krill. A five defensive back package for the Whalers. He hands it to number 38. Brought down almost immediately. That'll do it for the first quarter. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. He hands it to the runner. A flag on the play. Let's see what the call on the field is. Boston is going to go with the results of the play instead of the penalty. That'll bring up fourth down. The punt's away. Fielded at the 21-yard line. And he's brought down after a return of 17 Boston will begin the drive from the 40. <laughs> Delgado dropping back, makes the throw. He can't bring it in. Second down. it off yeah. 
First down. When you can pick up the first by running, it really opens up your playbook for the next set of downs. Hike! Forced out of bounds, up at the 35, second down. He makes the handoff. First down. Blocking can be one of the more overlooked aspects of running, but their impact on that first down run was pretty evident. And he's tackled up near the line by Porter. That gets us to second down. Delgado steps back into the pocket, makes the reception, and he stopped. That will move the chains. That's a well-run route and a precision pass for the first down. Delgado drops back. Delgado fakes the handoff and looks to pass. And they can't connect. Incomplete. Eight play of the drive. He tosses it to the runner. That will bring up third down. Boston lines up with two backs in the backfield. He hands it to the runner. Tackled quickly by number 52. That'll bring up fourth down. That's a smart play call. You were in a bad position on third down. Take a few yards and live to fight another day. Sutton on the kick. It's good. They convert from 31 yards out. Boston draws first blood today. Three, nothing. The home team has struggled out of the gate in a few games in the past, so this is a positive start. Sutton kicks this one away. Number 89 takes the kick. And he's brought down after a return of 13. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. to pass. Barker makes the sack. The offense will lose about seven. That gets us to second down. Fakes the handoff and looks to pass. Park with the catch. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. First down. <laughs> Steps into the pocket. Miami will fake the handoff and look to pass. That'll be enough for the first down. First down. He's tackled up near the line. Back at the 28. That gets us to second down. Second down. Chu back to pass. Throws a pass across the first down line. He's stopped. Good enough for a first down. A fresh set of downs for the offense. 
handoff is taken by number 38. Second down. Second and short. Handing it off to number 22. Eight play of the drive. Go. Chu, back to pass, finds a target along the left side. Those forced passes, Dave. If he keeps throwing in the coverage like that, it's going to end up six the other way. Back to pass. He makes the catch in the end zone for a touchdown. I think the defense was expecting run there. The linebackers' eyes were glued to the backfield, and they didn't give much coverage help to the DBs. Staba on the kick. And it's good. Miami will take the lead with that score. 7-3. The lead changes the mindset for both the offense and defense. I wonder if we won't see some guys taking more risks. Staba kicks it away. The kick is caught at the 11. Tackled after a return of 16. This is a pressure drive for the offense. They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. He flings a pass, and he can't reel it in. Hey. Drops back into the pocket, and they can't connect incomplete. Tight end right for the Whalers. Tonight. Miami will use one of their timeouts here. That brings up fourth down. I think that's a good call by the coach. There's still a lot of game left, and you don't want to force things and make a mistake here. Tonight. Morgan punts it away. Number 89 takes the kick. This drive coming up is a good chance for the offense to give themselves a bit of breathing room. Chu drops back. He throws one. He can't make the catch. Lining up on second down. Runner back to pass. Throws the ball. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. A crucial third down for the offense. Chu makes the handoff. Tackled quickly by... Keller, Boston, calls the first timeout. That brings up fourth down. That's a safe play on third down. When you've got a long way to go, sometimes you're better off just picking up a few yards and kicking it. He punts it away. Rowe takes the kick. Tackled after a return of eight. It's a one-score game, Dave. You have to feel good about your chances here if you're the offense. Let's see how they execute. Throws one along the right side. And he's brought down...
to Delgado, looking to pass. The ball falls to the ground, incomplete. Third down and short. Delgado drops back. The receiver can't bring it in. Sometimes you have to have that gunslinger mentality and take a shot to keep the defense on their toes. It didn't work out that time, but it will still let the D know that this QB isn't afraid to test them deep. <laughs> Morgan on the punt. Taken at the 27. It's a close one so far today. Let's see if the offense can extend their lead on this drive. The Warriors starts the drive from the 37-yard line. Chu back to pass. Perkin makes the reception. Miami will call their second time out here. And that's enough for a first down. Quick first downs like that keep the defense guessing. Tonight. There's the kick. And he makes it from 50. And that brings us to the end of the second quarter. The Warriors with the lead. 10-3. Sutton kicks it away. Number 89 takes the kickoff. Well, we've got a report from Emma Adams down on the field. Emma, what do you have for us? Dave, Mike, I spoke briefly with a coach for Boston during the break. He said he wasn't too worried about the score heading into the half and that the mistakes his team made were fixable. He finished by saying it's still anyone's game and they're looking forward to getting back onto the field in the third quarter. Back to you guys. Thanks for the update, Emma. Tonight. The handoff is taken by number 22. That gets us to third down. Play action pass. The ball falls to the ground, incomplete. Sometimes you have to have that gunslinger mentality and take a shot to keep the defense on their toes. It didn't work out that time, but it will still let the D know that this QB isn't afraid to test them Go. deep. The punt's away. The kick is caught at the 37. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. The handoff is taken by number 37. Second down. Second down and short. Hike. Santiago takes the carry. That'll be enough for the first down. Tight end on the right side. Austin will fake the handoff and look to pass. And he can't reel it in. Hike. Delgado with the top. Third down.
The Whalers with three receivers. Hike! Delgado with the handoff. That brings up fourth down. Well, it looks like we've got an injured player on the field. Out comes the field goal unit. on the kick and it will fall short of the uprights this drive represents a great opportunity to send the defense reeling another score to extend their lead would give them the ability to exercise a lot of control in terms of play calling Sit -hut. he sets up and throws across the first down line incomplete pass The Warriors lines up with one back in the backfield. Sit Dropping up. back. He throws one. He's tackled up at the 37-yard line. Hike. Drops back into the pocket. The receiver can't bring it in. This is exactly why third and long is so hard to convert. It takes time for the receivers to get to the first down marker, and by then, the QB is under pressure and forced to make a difficult throw. Hike. He punts it away. Taken at the 21. Tackled after a return of nine. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Delgado with the handoff. That gets us to second down. He hands it to number 37, and he won't make it very far before being dragged down up near the 39-yard line. Third down. Third down and short. He drops back, throws a pass past the first down. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. He's tackled up near the line. Second down. Go! Delgado hands it off. A crucial third down for the offense. Hike. Delgado hands it off. Tackled near the line by number 61. That'll bring up fourth down. The offense lines up to punt this one away. Morgan on the punt. And the punt sails into the end zone. Touchback. It's a close one so far today. Let's see if the offense can extend their lead on this drive. We've got an injured player down on the field. <laughs> Second down. He hands it off. Z 
to he steps back to pass. And he can't reel it in. Miami comes out in punt formation. He punts it away. The kick is caught at the 29-yard line. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Boston will start from the 38-yard line. Did he I... drops back. Play action pass. Sets his feet and throws way down the center of the field. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. The home team lining up with four receivers. Santiago on the run. The Whalers from the gun. Delgado back to pass. Pass complete to number 37. That signals the end of the third quarter. The Warriors with the lead so far. 10, 3. The offense lines up to punt this one away. Hike. He punts it away. The away team can make this a two-score game with a nice drive and finish here. Let's see if they can execute. Did he I... drops back to pass. Finds a target over the middle. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. Receiver gets up with a big first down motion. Pretty sure the defense have seen enough of that already. Buchanan takes the handoff. Second down. Tonight. He hands it to the runner. That will bring up third down. Third down and long. Hunt. Quarterback to pass. Tosses a pass. And he misses his mark. Miami comes out in punt formation. Punts it away. Fielded at the 17-yard line. The home team has to feel good about where they are. They're down by a single score and are in control of what happens next. The Whalers will begin the drive from the 26. Hey. Delgado back to pass. He is sacked in the backfield by number 61. Second down. Delgado, back to pass. He hurls one. Number 86 makes the reception. <laughs> Second down. He tosses it to the runner. 
That brings up a crucial third down. Hey. Delgado dropping back makes the catch. away and the pun sails into the end zone they'll bring it out to the 20 yard line if the offense can get another score in this drive here it will really put the pressure on Go. quarterback to pass he sets up and throws short over the middle second down Coming out in the gun. Go! Steps into the pocket. The ball falls to the ground. Incomplete. That'll bring up fourth down. A conservative run call on third and long. You don't want to unnecessarily take any risks there and end up in a situation that's difficult to recover from. He punts it away. Fielded at the 34. And he's brought down after a return of seven. This is a pressure drive for the offense. They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. Hike. Shaking off the tackler. That gets us to second down. That will bring up third down. Third down. Play action fake. And he misses his mark. Sometimes you have to have that gunslinger mentality and take a shot to keep the defense on their toes. It didn't work out that time, but it will still let the D know that this QB isn't afraid to test them deep. He tosses one near the sideline. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. Let's see what they do on first down. Delgado dropping back. Heaves a pass. Deep. It's caught in the end zone. Touchdown. There's just something manly about heaving a dead pig down the field to another player who's trying to muscle his way past defenders to score a touchdown. <laughs> I love it. Sutton kicks it up. Oh, and he's, he's not going to have enough leg. Boston bridges the gap a bit. Ten, nine. The home team pulls it into a one-score game there. The kick's away. Fielded at the 14-yard line. And he's brought down after a return of 12. This drive coming up is a good chance for the offense to give themselves a bit of breathing room. Can't bring it in. Uh -huh. 
Second play of the drive. Right. Steps into the pocket. Chew on the play action. That will bring up third down. We've got an injured player down on the field. A crucial third down for the offense. He drops back. He sets up and throws. The tackle is made up at the 42-yard line. Boston will call their first time out here. That will bring up first down. He tosses it to the runner. Boston will call their second time out here. That brings up second down. Coming out in the gun. And he can't reel it in. Miami comes out in a three receiver set. <laughs> Handing it off to number 38. Boston uses their last time out. A conservative run call on third and long. You don't want to unnecessarily take any risks there and end up in a situation that's difficult to recover from. Hike. Harrison punts it away. Rowe takes the punt. Tackled after a return of three. It's a one-score game, Dave. You have to feel good about your chances here if you're the offense. Let's see how they execute. Drops back into the pocket. Throws the ball. The slot receiver grabs the ball out of the air. That will move the chains Back-to-back -back first downs really has an impact on the crowd, too. Go! Drops back into the pocket. A penalty marker on the play. Tackle made at the 36-yard line. Let's see what the call on the field is. Boston accepts the penalty. You hope, as a defender, this isn't a trend. Technique means a lot, but you really won't even be taught to hold that way. Elgato looking to pass. Grabbed out of the air. And he's brought down by number 30, Miami. We'll use one of their timeouts here. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. Huge play here, Dave. Nearly broke it wide open. They've got the makings of a fantastic drive here. Miami calls their second timeout. Second down. The home team comes out in a three receiver set. Go! Pitches it out to number 37. The tackle is made by number 34. Miami takes their last timeout. That will bring up third down. Just a single back in the backfield for the Whalers. Hike. He hands it to the runner. Fourth down. Sometimes it's a good strategy to play the field position game. Get yards when you can and hope for a good stop on defense so you can give it another go closer to the end zone. There's the kick. And the kick will fall short. No good. This drive represents a great opportunity to send the defense reeling. Another score to extend their lead would give them the ability to exercise a lot of control in terms of play calling. Tonight. That will bring up second down. Lining up with five DBs. 
It's time to select the Mike Steele stud of the game. Mike, what player stood out to you today? Today, I'm picking Chu for the away team. Talk about a guy that loves football. It really showed on the field today.